Hello. I noticed you're observing from back there. Yeah, I was listening to the conversation actually. Uh, do you know why they're there? Because of the other ones, right? Yeah. Yeah, uh, they're showing the public how they contribute to the worst animal cruelty on earth imaginable through their consumer choices. Yeah. 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 So what do you think about what they're doing here? Well, they just want to show that it's actually not animals yeah. because they have a choice, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's just yeah. yeah, yeah. How does it make you feel to see this? Uh, controversial. So. <laughs> it's great to think, like, okay, what's happening? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you know that that's how your food was produced? I don't eat meat, so... <laughs> Are you a vegetarian? Yes. Okay, but, yeah, we need to speak to vegetarians as well because the dairy industry slaughter the cows, they take away their calves, they kill the boys too on the first week of life. Um, the females will grow up to be milk producers too. They'll have their children taken. I drink like a vegetarian milk, I would say. I don't think oh, you mean a plant-based milk? Yeah. So why would you call yourself a vegetarian and not a vegan? Uh, I like eggs. Okay, eggs, the egg industry. Yeah, so there's a, we, we target vegetarians too because the egg industry is just as bad as the meat industry. Yeah, but I like eggs. I'm selfish. Ah, you're selfish. So you don't care about the fact that you abuse animals through consumption of eggs? Well, I, of course I do care, but I also am selfish. Yeah, so, well, I mean, you might be selfish. Do you think that that's okay, to be selfish in the face of the cruelty? I think I do already enough. You think you do enough? Yes. But in the eyes of those animals that are being tortured, do you think it's enough to still consume the eggs, even though, like... How about your clothing, for example, and I don't mm. know, where it, where's it come from? You want to point to the clothes? We want to talk about eggs, we want to talk about clothing. Yeah, it's like Where does yours come from? Yeah, exactly. It's, it, just, it has no animal products in there. No, it doesn't. No. But you, know, you don't know who produced that, who maybe is tortured to produce that, or you know, put a lot of effort to do it. So. Well, there's no slavery in these clothings, if, if that's what you think. Do you know? Like, how do you know? I mean, well, I can prove to you that your eggs come from macerated male chicks because they don't produce eggs. No, my eggs are coming from my grandma's like small chickens. So, so you, so, chickens. okay, so you only eat eggs at your grandma's, so you don't yeah. eat eggs? I don't, I only eat the one which are the number zero, whatever. Which so you, from, from you go to your grandma's house and you eat eggs, but outside here you're a vegan? Yeah, I know. Um, most of the time at least. Yeah. So when you're, you're either a vegan or you're not a vegan, because a vegan's a philosophy against animal abuse, yeah, yeah? I don't have a philosophy about animal, I have a philosophy about environment. Okay. I care about the environment yeah. more than this has nothing to do with the environment. This is all yeah. to do with animal abuse. Yeah, definitely, I can see that. Yeah. So when you purchase eggs, yeah, male chicks and massive. Well, they are. Well, you're not a vegan outside of your grandma's house. You said that you're a, you're not a vegan. You I'm said only vegan. sometimes you eat these products outside here. I also eat fish. Yeah. So you kill fish. So that a vegan. I don't kill fish. <laughs> you eat the fish. I eat fish. Yeah. So you're paying for fish to be tortured and killed as well. Not really, because I also get it from uh, from the house, like from the farm. Do you consume fish outside here? I don't live here. <laughs> so what do you eat when you're out? What do you consume when you're out here when you're hungry? You, don't, you, you just eat vegan food? Most of the time, plants, yes. Veggies. <laughs> most, of the but with those, most of the times, those times where you don't. Yeah, let's just say burger with, um, with putty or with, uh, what is it, mushrooms or whatever. That's, that's my dinner yesterday. Today, what did I eat today? Um, I went for the bread with um, asparagus, um, zucchini and um, vegan cheese on it. Vegan cheese. So I'm not here to interrogate you, yeah. okay? But when you say you're not a vegan, I'm here to speak for the animals. So when you sometimes are a vegan and sometimes not, th those, those sometimes abuse and kill animals. I'm not here to be your friend or this person's friend. I'm here to speak for those animals that are being tortured That's and killed. Totally and you know, like, so I'm not trying to sell anything to you. I don't want any money from you. And that's it. And, I, and I'm sorry that if I made you feel uncomfortable, but from those animals' eyes, that they're, they're, they're yeah, screaming just, out for mercy. I just kind of, feel, yeah. I just kind of feel like you push, of course, animal philosophy on someone who mm. has a little bit different point of view on different things. And mm. how to say, there's a lot of other things as well to focus on. So I feel, from my opinion, being a tiny bit already putting a little bit of effort, not eating meat, for example, not eating eggs from like a big farms, not eating. I don't know, some other stuff. They eat fish. They eat fish. They're from they're from the anything. ocean. They didn't small, want to die. Small parts of it already. It's a big thing to do instead mm. of like being trying to put your philosophy on someone. Well, to, we have the same try, philosophy. Try to put. What's your philosophy on animal abuse and torture? 
you should not torture animals. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. So we we believe the same thing, except yeah. sometimes you you do abuse animals through your lifestyle. Do you have leather shoes, for example? No. You don't wear leather or anything. No. Like why that? do you ask? I'm against animal abuse. I wouldn't wear their skin. Yeah, That's I'm, horrible. I'm wondering, or um, I don't know, some animal products, cosmetics. Do you wear leather shoes? I don't wear leather shoes. Yeah, they come from a tortured animal slave. Yeah, but uh, they last for a longer time. They, they I don't come. care. If they were made from exactly. your skin, I wouldn't wear them out of principle. But then imagine, you use the shoes which are mm -hmm. probably you have to buy them every second month or whatever. I wouldn't wear skin made of you either. It's out of principle, moral principle. And then you kind of uh, push your, um, all the environment to move further and then getting all the push fires and then you kill animals. This is, a, this is an animal rights issue. Yeah, I know. It's taking someone's rights away and murdering them. It's yeah. different to the environment. Yeah, but that's also an issue to look at. So, yeah. you know, if you look, it's an issue to look at, but that's not what we're looking at. Yeah. We're looking at enslaving and killing animals for your lifestyle, shoes and eggs and fish and yeah. you know, animals are being tortured and killed. Yeah. They're being abused for you. Fair enough. Yeah. How about uh, environment, for example? That's not a topic for us. This, I know, the, but the topic let's... here is being the animals that are being abused and tortured for your yeah. lifestyle. So when you leave here. You either, you either pay for animal abuse thing. or you don't. It's exactly the no, it's same not. thing. It's just not their choice. Slavery, animal slavery and the environment are very yeah. different topics. Yeah. Very different topics. Okay, fair enough. Mm. But um, pain of the animals, for example? Sorry, the pain. Pain, yeah. Yeah, pain's one thing. Yeah. Enslaving and murdering is another. Yeah. Dragging fish out the ocean, they suffocate and they, they're harmed. Okay. Yeah. And then you go along and eat them. And then you... How about killing animals by pushing... Um, all the um, environment and not friendly things in in, uh, uh, in the world and stuff like that. Like here, I'm so really I'm so disappointed about this country in general about the way uh, we torture and kill animals. As well as being so. Where are you from? I'm from Poland. Yeah. I live in Denmark. There's gas chambers there in Poland for, for pigs. I don't know. I don't. Know horrible. Pigs. Yeah, I know you, you don't. You already explained. Poland and Australia are not too much different in their yeah, animal but exploitation. I don't live in Poland. I live in Denmark. Okay. That's even more for pigs, like the biggest killing pigs is in Denmark, I would say. Yeah. Because that's the main dish for a country. And they try to limit that. And of course, it's the same, the same actually subjects or topics to talk to about uh, not having the meat industry as not having the coal mines here in Australia. Because people will not have jobs, they will not have money. I don't care about that. that. Yeah, exactly. Do you care about the people who are in th that have jobs enslaving human beings to pick their cotton? No, we don't. We care about the people that have been enslaved. In the same way, I don't care about those who are enslaving and torturing the animals. I care about the animals that are being tortured. Yeah, I think we have just different philosophy. Yeah, we no, do. You're against animal abuse. Do you care about the animal abuser or the animal being abused? Yeah, but I also think that you're a bit too much to push it. So. Well, how do you care about child abuse? The same way? Do you care about the child abuser or the child that's being abused? Well, it depends what we're talking about. Abortion? No, I'm talking about no, child abuse. Do you care about the child or the person that's abusing that child? Which, which do you care about more, the victim or the oppressor? Well, of course the victim. Okay, well I care more about the victim than I do about people's jobs. Okay. That's like spitting in the face of the victim. Mm -hmm. A bit of money to torture an animal? Yeah. They can get another job. Obviously. Yeah. Like anyone else, you could get another job. Yeah, I don't, I don't abuse animals, I, I stop the abuse of animals. Yeah, I'm trying as well, as much as I can. We don't try, we just don't. That's it, because you're, you're against it. So you live in alignment with your, your good-hearted, compassionate person. So you live in alignment with that. You don't sometimes abuse animals if, you've got a, if you're against animal abuse. When you leave here today, you're not going to pay for animals to be abused, or you might still... Perhaps. I can promise you. Okay. Thanks for being honest with me. I hope you appreciate the way that I was honest with I, you as well. I definitely appreciate it. Yeah. Do you think I've got a good chance in getting people to stop this? Yeah, definitely. Or at least limits. Maybe not stop, but limits. Mm. And I think that's already a big step. And I just wouldn't lie to someone and say, hey, it's okay sometimes. I'm, like, I wouldn't lie to someone like that. Yeah, of course, you cannot say that. But I still would think and would say that it's better to limit than, than not do anything. I could say the same thing about beating my wife. I could, it's better for me to limit it than... Can, than You're beating your wife? I could say the same thing. It's a hypothetical. I don't beat my wife, of course. I'm against... Are you? I'm saying, if someone were to say to you, yeah. I should beat my wife less, yeah. Or not beat them at all. Yeah. What if, would you say? If you would do anything to that, then yeah. she should leave you straight away. Yeah, of course. Of course. So if you beat her even once, she should leave you. Of course. And you should be arrested and go to prison. Yeah? Maybe not prison. If you beat prison? your wife, you should go to prison. Okay. Yeah. Like if you do, that's why I say don't limit, mm. don't reduce your consumption of animal abuse. Mm. Stop it. Just like domestic violence. Stop it. It's evil. <laughs> it's 
least a, if you can limit at least a little bit, it's already good. But I wouldn't limit something else evil. But you I know, just you know it's impossible to reduce it to zero, and that's fact. What do you mean? Like What's you're it? not able to reduce all harm. You mean? <laughs> you mean reducing all harm? Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's not possible to reduce all harm, but we don't go around raping and killing each other because you can't reduce all harm. But something as direct as paying someone to be stabbed in the throat. It's easy to stop. Yeah, but again, you're not able to say to people who have nothing else to eat in Africa, or whatever, than meat. Luckily, you're we're in Australia. Luckily, we're we're in Australia advocating to this people person here. Not, don't live here. We're not. In, I'm not in advocating to an African tribe. Yeah, I know, but I'm just what I'm saying. You're not able to limit the zero. It's better to mm. put it down. Yeah, uh, maybe there's people that won't stop. They're just happy to abuse yeah, animals. Yeah, that's amazing. And so. I, I'm super appreciate. Like, if you don't eat eggs, that's amazing. And I wish, I okay, I know I can do it. You can, you can right now. I know, but I like eggs and I use protein as well from the eggs. Yeah, I've get all the protein I need. Been vegan six years. Proteins are really a non-argument in this day and age. Uh, of course not, but uh, you don't need protein from eggs. But you can get them from eggs. You can. You can also get protein from shit. But we don't have to eat shit. Have you tried? <laughs> no, no, no. You but like you know, it? I'd rather eat beans and rice and lentils well, and that, you know. If an animal has to be tortured for protein, it's not good. That was a classic example of I'm doing enough. And um, yeah, she kept moving the goalpost. So I didn't really believe her at some points. But you know, sometimes, just remember, sometimes people will tell you what you want to hear. So you, you let them off the hook. But um, yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh.